So, if you're watching this video, you might be wondering, what is Vestige of the Past? And I can answer that in a video that I have, you know, made previously on this channel. So, if you don't know what Vestige of the Past is, go ahead and check that out. I have a video up called, What is Vestige of the Past? And in that, I just highlight certain features of gameplay and what the game is kind of about. So, let's get into how alcohol works in the game vestige of the past so whenever you drink any alcoholic beverage the alcohol level in your blood changes so just like in real life your alcohol you know the the level in the blood it goes up or you know down depending on whether or not the alcohol is being broken down by your body so it'll take about one hour to reach the peak level of alcohol in your blood and that's what it says on the website i don't know if it means an hour in game times hour or like one hour in real time but maybe there is a different like a different kind of hour or whatever i don't i don't know guys so the body will begin to break down the alcohol and you'll slowly actually be sobering up and then dehydration will also kick in along with other negative effects that are caused by actually drinking the alcohol alcohol can you know be used in game if you're trying to talk to a certain character some characters won't even talk to you if you're sober so if you want to drink alcohol like maybe you should just drink all the time so you can talk to everybody and also i don't know if you can get other people drunk in the game but i think that maybe if you are drinking with someone else then they might tell you something differently or say something differently in a game or give you something who knows that's pretty much the social aspect of it but it can also you know positively help your you know illnesses or in even increase your health and alcohol may seem like not a very big part of a game but like if some characters in the game won't even talk to you when you're sober maybe you should just be drunk every day all the time in this game and next i'm going to show you guys some pretty cool stuff that has been shown on the forums or not on the forums but on the dev blogs and if you guys want to go actually check out the dev blogs just go to the vestige of the past website and you can find all the same information that i am talking about right here uh, in those forums, but if you don't feel like going and reading all those and I'll always make videos and kind of talk about each each uh, one if it's important to the game development So let me show you this bus though So I don't know if it's just me, but this bus does look pretty gosh darn cool So just like the way the color is and like the kind of the scheme of the way that they're going in this like I feel like it's gonna be kind of a old-timey simulation game but I feel like there's gonna be a quite of a unique storyline on this game and you know going past like the survival aspects and the, the fact that you have to make your own food and stuff I feel like the story of this game is gonna make it so much better and with all these aspects I feel like you know it not just being a survival game is gonna shape up really nice for this game so if you guys did enjoy this video make sure you go ahead and leave a like maybe drop a subscription if you want to see more vestige of the past videos and i also do make a lot of videos like this um with you know covering indie games and games that not a lot of people know about but just enough people know about to where it's good to actually make news over so if you guys do want more of this in the future go ahead and follow me on instagram twitter and uh, i'll see you guys in the next video peace